Jimmy Kimmel response to Trump's equal laughs demand, take my show, please. In response to the President of the United States tweet this morning vetching about partisanship in late night comedy, Kimmel joined Seth Meyers in providing punchlines to the slow pitch lob. See all tweets below. Trump's tweet was one of three this morning complaining about the media and equal time, he singled out NBC News, without mentioning that whole moron story the organization broke, and while the final two pivoted to news coverage, the first suggested what's really gotten his goat this morning. Late night hosts are dealing with the Democrats for their very unfunny ampersand repetitive material, always anti-Trump. Should we get equal time? Despite the singular host, Trump seems to be blaming all late-nighters, and leaves it unclear how exactly the hosts are dealing with the Democrats. At first read, dealing could be interpreted as handling, that is, the hosts are handling, or joking about, Democrats. Which makes no sense with the always anti-Trump follow-up. So maybe he's suggesting collusion between the hosts, or one host in particular, and the Democrats. Like, just maybe. The health care advice Kimmel reportedly received from Chuck Schumer. In any case, ABC's host of Jimmy Kimmel Live has an answer for the equal time thing. Excellent point Mr. President. Tweeted Kimmel. You should quit that boring job, I'll let you have my show all to yourself pound sign MAGA. And earlier this morning, Seth Meyers offered an invitation of his own. The host of NBC's Late Night tweeted, We'd love to have you. Studio located at 15 Penguin Avenue, Antarctica. Something tells us this isn't the last we've heard of this debate. Anyway, here are the tweets, in chronological order. And note, Trump's specific mention of NBC comes after NBC's Myers makes the Antarctica joke, 